The pet safe travel package um, is fairly simple, um, but does a lot of things, so we'll try and make sense of it. Um, to start and stop the van via the remote, um, if you're in the proximity of the van, um, as if the remote works, you can lock the van. All you gotta do is lock, unlock, and lock. You'll see it kick on and go to high idle. Obviously with it in high idle, alternator is going to be running at the right speed. Your compressor is going to be riding at the right speed. The van can sit like this for indefinite time in your opinion um, it just depends on how long you want to run fuel it's very efficient this way it very it pretty much sips fuel because it's running like a generator um, it'll keep all of your rear air factory air um, it all comes back up um, to the temperature you had set previously um, and then to overtake it or shut it off if you needed to if you didn't let it run all the way through its cycle or predetermined time just do the same steps, lock, unlock, lock, and it'll decrease the idle and go down. Um, the other option to control the remote start is through the drone app, um, which is pretty simple. Um, you just go to your phone and pull up the drone app. Dun, dun, dun. I've got a few cars on here, so it's a little bit more... <laughs> So we'll add a car, and pretty much all you have to do is come to the door of the van where we put the scan code for your van, and it'll pull it up, and you activate it that way. It'll allow you to remote access, for instance, this van right here. You can start, stop it. You can lock, unlock it. You can also add drivers. You can see the voltage. Um, you can also add some additional triggers if you'd like. Um, if we did a lithium kit and you wanted to add an auto gen start more or less to uh, recharge the battery, we could set that up for you. Um, but from the inside, let's go inside. Brandon, I'll show you how kind of the high level and stuff works from inside. So I've got the high idle on like we started it from inside the house per se. And if I want to take it over, all I've got to do is come in and hit this button with my foot on the brake. The motor essentially shuts, comes back up, and now I have control of the van with the key so you can actually drive it. Because the nice thing about the pet safe package is that you can run the van and lock it, secure your goods, all your, your items. Um, obviously your pets can sit um, in an air-conditioned uh, vehicle and not have any issues. Um, while you're sitting in the van or if you're in one of our day cruisers and you're just parked for a long period of time and you want to activate the high idle all you have to do is pull the e-brake and click the turn signal and you'll see it going into high idle and this is the best setup for this van to sit with all the components running whether it be the rear air um, which is motor driven because what you can do is essentially if you were sitting at a ballpark or an event all day you guys are sitting in there for a few hours you want it to be in high idle so it's running efficiently and you're getting your air conditioner working correctly and it's not drowning down the chassis um, i'll show you guys one more thing pretty much if you want to undo the the high idle you can just drop the e-brake or put your foot on the brake it'll kill it as well <clears throat> um, if you wanted to I do this, we do this a lot out here because it's hot. Um, you can essentially leave everything up and running with your faster power on, get out, kill the motor like normal. And then when you, okay. then you can just remote start it from outside. And you'll notice that air and everything comes back up to temp and now you can leave the van locked and go in for the store or go into a restaurant if you're traveling with your animals and uh, they're safe and happy outside the van while you're enjoying inside and then you come out to a nice cold van.
So that's pretty much it, guys. Um, if you need anything else, if you have any questions, feel free to give us a shout. Um, we're kind of always adjusting this, making it better. If you've got some input, we're more than happy to hear. Um, or if you have a question, maybe you wanted to do something for you, or you have a question on uh, service and things like that, don't hesitate to drop us a line or check online for our um, tips and uh, common questions. We always have answers and stuff that come up that we try to keep active and up to date. So thanks again, guys. Take care. We'll see you next time.